Now, I'm answering a question about how to handle ourselves if we are, you know, someone is suppressing us continuously. So what can we do? The answer is, first, we don't take the suppression because this is garbage. But it's difficult. So every day we have to say, God loves me, I can have peace of the Lord, I can have joy of the Lord, I can have strength of the Lord. And when I trust in God, God is very happy. So we um, don't take the suppression. Whatever he said, we just don't take it. The main thing, now this is very hard for many people. When he yelled at you, you just regard as singing. He's singing. It's, let it disappear in the air. Let the words di disappear in the air. Don't think about it. Just say, that is his problem. I have the joy of the Lord, I have strength of the Lord. Now that is difficult, but that's something, that's the idea of don't eat garbage. Don't eat garbage means when people mistreat you, don't take it. Don't regard it as serious. And then trust in God's love and enjoy God's love, and then we can have joy and strength. Now, as far as what to do depends. If the suppression is really serious, then I would suggest you find a way to move out, move away. If it's very, very serious suppression, then you have to find a way out. If every day the person beats you up, if every day the person yells at you for six hours, every day is making it impossible for you to live, to live there, then you have to find a way out. Um, so we, we handle that. At the same time, you're nice to the person, and hopefully there's a, that God can use us to change. But sometimes when people suppress us, and then we get angry, then it's making things worse. Because normally, most people would just get angry all the time, and then the other person would get more angry. Okay, in assignment, describe the condition. That means, describe this person. It's my husband, my, my friend, my child, and he yells at me all the time, he kicks me all the time, he hits me up all the time, he, whatever he does, that's the condition that you are in, and then how do you handle that? You understand? So whatever way that person is persecuting you, giving, giving you a hard time, you describe that, and then you try to handle it. 